What is up, everybody? We are back with our third and probably last, but maybe not, depending on how things go, CMF Series 24 bag opening. I've gotten nearly all of the figures in this series between the first two videos, but we don't have this princess yet, and that might be the only one. We'll take a peek at the insert when we get one of these open and double check for that, but we'll be hoping to open opening we'll be hoping to be opening at least one of this princess today uh, I did see rumors that there's gonna be a new Disney series and it will have 18 different figures in it instead of 12 so that would be cool all right first first we have what is probably my personal favorite figure from this series, the Potter. Uh, I just really, really enjoy the detailing on the torso with the shiny scissors and the clay on the smock there on the pants. I like the purple and the teal coloring. I think this is my favorite figure from the series. The printing on this... Uh, this uh, head wrapping here, just super cool all around. Big fan of the Potterer. Let's go ahead and open the Potterer, the Potter, the insert here, and uh, see what's going on. Oh, yeah, so we got boom, and she's like holding. All right, there we have it. We got the Potter. So let's take a look at the sheet. Obviously, we got yes, 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 yes. All right, so we are only missing the princess. I'm pretty sure I only got one of the uh, brown spaceman, maybe one of the orc. Got at least a couple of everything else, I think, but we will be looking for... The princess. Ha! Well, would you look at that, folks? Ask and ye shall receive. It's really that easy. That's just that good, clean living. That gets me where I need to go. And we got the princess. She's got this little dog here. Can she hold the dog? I think so. All right. Look at that. Awesome. Well, that completes the series here. Uh, so as far as stuff I want to open is, I guess, whichever ones are the most valuable for my store. I don't know how that princess is, but I believe Space Baby is one of the better ones. I think it's Space Baby... And the Falconer, maybe, are the two most expensive. I haven't sold the Princess yet, so I uh, don't really know. But love to get... I Probably I'll keep this one for myself, because I hadn't yet. Uh, I don't really collect any minifigures. I generally pass them all along through my store, which you can see in uh, the links down below in the description for this video. I don't really keep any minifigure collection because I always feel like I should keep them moving through my store for liquidity. There's a number of figures I've gotten in use collections before and whatnot that I've wanted to keep. Um, look at that, back-to-back -back Space Babies, that's awesome. So yeah, I, I would love to have a nice big minifigure collection, but you know what? I already have a pretty big set collection, some of which have their own minifigures. I play a lot of Magic the Gathering, and I collect Magic cards. I play guitar, and I have multiple guitars, and you can only do so much. And if I get addicted to building my own minifigure collection, that'll become its own problem. So, you know, let's wait. Maybe when I get 100,000 subscribers someday, I can start uh, building up my own collection. 
But until then, you can find these minifigures for sale in my store. What kind of... Oh, wow, this is insane. Back to back to... We are going to have an army of space babies. You know what? I can't really complain. I do have... I like what people are doing with the Everyone is Awesome set and putting a spaceman now that the brown one exists of the correct color in each of the stripes on the everyone is awesome set i believe it's like the purple one that you can't get all together but the tank and the helmet or something like that came in one of the ninjago sets recently so now you can you can make the entire figure happen by using parts in two different sets and thus complete the everyone is awesome what do you think you guys think i should do that one leave a comment down below if you think i should make the spaceman everyone is awesome i think this guy's one of the more expensive pieces he's got this custom molded helmet here which is pretty pretty aggressive it's uh i think it's called space warrior and he's got a see the instructions here to remind myself how to build this gun got a couple side pieces Triple roller skate on the front. Uh, followed by this like old nozzle piece. And I think there's this down here. Oh no. Oh. There we go. There is Space Warrior. Alright, we've got uh, four bags left here. Let's see if we can wrangle up another princess. Or some more falconers. Oh, here's the uh, like newsy kid. I would call him. I can't remember what the official name for some of these figures are, but it's a cool figure too. I like the patch printing on the pants there. That's pretty sweet. Uh, it'd be cool if the belt was printed on the belt area of the legs there, but no such luck. All right, we've got our second potter of the day. I don't know that this is, I don't think this is one of the, I think this is on like the lower side as far as expense goes, which is kind of interesting because it's got multiple pieces going on here, but I digress because it is still my favorite figure from this series. Two bags left. Let's see what we got. This one feels like a princess again. You can feel that big blocky uh, dress piece. Nice. So that's cool. We got two of the figure that I had not opened. That is always welcome. Got a couple different expressions on here. There, we are going to get some high resolution footage of this figure. Absolutely. So you'll be able to uh, tune in and see that probably tomorrow, but uh, certainly within the next couple of days. All right, and lastly, we have another Space Warrior. Well, thank you guys for tuning in for another CMF24 opening. I don't believe I'll do any more of these. Now we have completed an entire collection on video. But it was a pretty fun series to open. Let me know down in the comments below. I'm really curious to see what all you guys, uh, what your favorite figures from this collection are. As I mentioned, the Potter is mine. Mostly due to uh, I really enjoy the torso and the leg printing. 
but certainly Space Baby, the brown spaceman with the Space Baby, has got to be up there. And there's some other good ones as well. I really like the rocking horse, the molded rocking horse piece. That comes with the little girl figure. So there's definitely some winners in this series. Remember to like and subscribe down below if you enjoyed this content. And tune in for daily videos.